Hi everyone, today I'm going to be doing a haul. It's been a minute since I've done a haul. So if you're interested to see what I got, then stay tuned. So I'm gonna be showing you some things that I purchased at the drugstore, and then we're gonna move on to more high-end and then some other stuff. So the first thing I got is the Wet n Wild uh, One Step Wonder Gel Nail Polish in the color Stay Classy. And it's this beautiful pink. I'm gonna zoom in so you guys can see. It's this gorgeous sort of muted pink and this is like a two-in-one It's supposed to last a lot longer and it's just a beautiful con kind of uh, mauve pink I think it's perfect for spring and I do love these wet and wild nail polishes So I wanted to try the one-step gel knowledge <laughs> one-step wonder gel um, And I do like it. I had it on I think in my previous video but Yeah, I really do like this color and I think I'm gonna get more but this is the one in stay classy And I think it's just a beautiful color for spring. So that's the first thing I also got another uh, Wet n wild product and I just I saw that Wet n wild has a lot of new things so I checked out one of the uh, liquid lipsticks. This is the Mega Last Liquid Cat Suit Matte Lipstick in the color uh, Rebel Rose, and it's another kind of like my color. You guys already know what I like to wear, so I'm just gonna show you. It's just a really beautiful. Um, I don't know. It's kind of like my color. I also love the doe food applicator, but the only thing is that this is really drying. So. It's really, it's just a really nice color. I love it, but it's really um, dry, like when you put it on your lips. Like right now, I'm wearing a, a liquid lipstick by Ofra, and it's a moisturizing this. You're going to see that it's going to get dry and um, just really, really dry. So just keep that in mind, but I do love the color, and I think I'm going to get more. It's just... If you're not into super drying liquid lipsticks, then you're not going to like this. But if you do and you don't mind, then this will be great. Once again, this is called Rebel Rose. I also needed a new lip balm, so I decided to get the Chapstick Total Hydration uh, Chapstick in the scent Sweet Peach. It says 3-in-1 Lip Care, and it's just a clear chapstick, but I do love it. It has... A really really nice scent and I do like the packaging I think it's just great I've been using this a lot because my lips have been super dry so I would really recommend it um, chapstick uh, just the brand in general I really like it and my lips have been super dry so I feel like this has helped me a lot I also like to wear this before I apply any liquid lipsticks not when I use Ofra but if I was using this I would wear this on the bottom just to give me a little bit more moisture and doesn't look super dry but it's drying already and you can see it's kind of still wet, but some parts are dry and you can kind of emphasize on the wrinkles of the lips. So that's why I would like to wear this on the bottom and then a liquid lipstick. Now the last thing from Wet n Wild is the Wet n Wild Illumini Highlight and Concealer Pen. I got it in the color uh, Posing Nude and it's a little bit too dark. I like to really wear a super light concealer to kind of highlight and help with my dark circles and I do like the concealer it's definitely not a super full coverage concealer uh, this is more of a concealer that would be great to sort of spot correct any of my blemishes around my face just because it is kind of like the color of my skin and like I said I do like to wear something a little bit lighter to highlight underneath my Eyes and oh, the last thing I forgot to show you is that I finally decided to get a Real Techniques uh, blending a sponge, and it's dirty because I used it today to blend, but I do like it. I do like the shape that it's flat, and it helps blend everything out really quickly. And then I like the pointy for the concealer. It's been years, and I've never tried it, and I decided to try it, and I really do like it. Um, I don't know how I feel about which one I like more if it's this one or my beauty blender but I do like it I think um, it's a really good dupe um, but I still do love my beauty blender so this is still a really good alternative it's really cheap it was only like five dollars or less so I really recommend it if you haven't tried it like I haven't in years uh, to try it out and see which one you like most so those are the only things that I got from the drugstore now we're gonna move on to Sephora and Ulta and then a brand that I was sent a few things that I'm really excited so I decided to get once again the It Cosmetic Your Skin But Better CC Cream with SPF of 50 I have 
or had, I still have a little bit of it, and the, this one that I got last year in the color light, but I decided this time around to get the color medium because I am planning on getting dark hopefully in the spring and summer. So I decided to get another one just because spring and summer is coming and I do love that this has SPF 50 plus UVA, UVB, which is great. Uh, you know, my skin, I'm getting more mature and I do want to protect my skin from the sun. And I actually had it on earlier. Right now I do have a, a little bit more of a full coverage uh, foundation just because I'm going out. But I love it. I think it's a great uh, CC cream for every day. So I'm glad that I got it. And this time around, I got it in the color medium. It's not that much of a difference, but you can tell a little bit of the difference. With the purchase, I got a gift, and this is by Bite. I love Bite. You guys know that. Bite, and this is the matte cream lip crayon in the color um, pastel. pastel. Um, I don't have this color, and it's just... It's just a sample size, but I love, 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 love. It's just a beautiful, this is also like a perfect like spring color. It kind of matches this liquid lipstick, but it's a little bit more pink as you can see. Love it. Let me just zoom you in so you guys can see. This is called Pastel. Past, pastel? Pastel. Pastel. <laughs> I don't know. I'll have the name down below so you guys can check it out and then I went to Ulta and I got a huge set that was on sale this is the show off your style by Ulta and it's a huge sample of different hair products and it was only $10 so I decided to get this because as you can see my hair has been changing a lot recently and I decided that this would be a great uh, thing to buy and sort of see what it like and because I realized that my hair is changing a lot and I don't know what to wear on my hair. Uh, right now I'm just wearing a little bit of the mousse from this from this um, box, this gift box. I am wearing the Matrix Oil Wonders Volume Rose Plumping Mousse and it's just a sample size. I do like it. It smells really good as well and it doesn't give me like that crunchy feel. I do love the way it looks. This is one of the things that came in. Another thing that it came with is the Unwash Dry Cleaner. This is by The New Clean. It's just a dry shampoo. Dry shampoo is always necessary, so I'm glad that it came with that. It also came with the Matrix 20 Miracle Creator. This is a multitasking treatment, and it's just a sample size, which you can put like kind of like a leave-in conditioner, a leave-in treatment. Then I got the Redken CC Climate Control Care. This is for all curls, which is what I have right now, or I'm trying to have. And I don't know if it's a spray, it's like a gel. Yeah, it's just a clear gel. Let me put this like underneath to give it a little bit more. Another thing that I got is the Prep Rally. This is a Prime and Prep Detangler um, by Dry Bar. Now my hair doesn't get tangled at all, but if it starts getting tangled, um, I'll definitely wear this. Then I also got two hairsprays. The first one is by John Master Organics Hairspray. So my camera died and I had to change clothes. So let's just continue. The next thing that I got in the kit is the KMS California Free Shape Hot Flex Spray. Spray Flex. So it's just a uh, flexible hairspray. And I haven't tried this, so I'm really intrigued to try it. It says... He activated shaping and whole style. So that's something that I would probably need. Last but not least, in the box, it came with this step one and step two from AG Hair Care. This is the cleansing cream and the moisturizing mask. And it's just in this packaging. I decided to try the treatment because my hair is a little bit damaged from all of the hair dyes. I have a bunch of like little hairs because it has broken. So now we're going to move on to the last stuff from like beauty products. This is actually skincare. This was actually sent to me by the brand Belize in You. So I decided to try this product. This is the brand Belize in You. And this is the Marine Skin and Body Care. This is the Marine Mineral Skin Toner. And it came in this beautiful packaging. This is glass and it's just a pump. And I just use this with a cotton uh, round and I just put it all over my skin. I've been using it for a little bit. It has a really light sun, but I'll talk about it more in my next video. I'm still trying it out, so I'll let you guys know how I like it. The next thing that I receive is the Hydro Bliss Thirsty Skin Elixir. And this is also by 
uh, Belize and You, and this is just sort of a um, serum. Apply it. So I apply two or three drops of this into my skin in the morning and in the evening. And the last thing is the C Defense AM Cream. So my camera died yesterday. I really don't know what happened. I was freaking out because it didn't want to turn on even though my battery was supposedly charged. <laughs> but I think it was my battery. So I am filming um, the next day. And I think I finished talking about all of the products um, that I was uh, sent. So like I said, I've been testing out the Belize uh, in you products and I'll let you know a little bit more about it uh, probably in the next few videos um, And sort of tell you if I like them or not, but so far they're really good and I've been trying them out 